The officials are ready. The boxers are ready. Time to introduce the main event. Firstly, in the red corner, he's a two-weight Midlands area champion from Blockswitch, the undefeated James Beach Jr. And across the ring stands the champion from Litchfield, the undefeated Brad the Blade Foster. Well, they've sparred together, as I told you. And James Beach says that trying to box Brad Foster is like trying to box a wasp. He said he is very, very quick and he stings. See, when she holds your feet against Foster, you've got to watch what you're doing. Foster there working well to the body. Well, that was a low one. Left hand, he got away with it though. Yeah, he's a tough black country kid, Beach. But, you know, he's standing and he's trading. Good body shot there inside from Foster, lovely left hand, and again. That's how Richie's got it in our main event of the night here at the BT studio. But it is very close and has the makings of a good fight and a gruelling fight. That's good work up close from Foster. Oh, that's what I was talking about earlier, about slipping the shot as you're going forward. That was a perfect example there, what he did. Going forward, slips the shot, draws the punch from his opponent, slips and then comes back with the counter. Good, right good work. Up, good right hand as well, uh, clipped the side of Beecher's head. There's a little bit of a, a, little bit of a smear of blood from the left eye of James Beach. So what's that, 3-2, you've got Foster ahead? Foster's ahead, just 3-2 for me. There hasn't been a lot in the rounds, to be quite honest. And there's no quarter given by either man here. Beach not allowing himself to be bullied around. Good body shot there from Beach. And you just heard the corner there saying he's done, brother. They're thinking that the beach is starting to tire, maybe, John, in this well, round. Is it just a, a hint that he is starting to feel the pace, perhaps, a little bit more? Good right hand. The beach fighting back bravely off the ropes. So eighth round of this 12 rounder for the British and Commonwealth Super Bantamweight title. Just trying to draw the lead, isn't he, Foster, on the outside there. Just waiting, waiting for Beats to throw the shot, maybe to fall short and make him miss, but Beats there, fair play to him. A couple of good shots went in there from Beach. So he's not falling into the trap, he's not falling short. Jim Beach being implored to keep working. He heard loudly the voice of Peter Hickenbottom in the corner. And this time he does get through. And only with a glancing blow with that right hand. I think the slower pace suits Beach, personally, John, but uh, when he puts his foot on the gas, Foster. He boxes much better. They're really trying to rev up Jim Beach here, trying to get him to move on to another level. Beach getting through with that right hand, I think, over the top. Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? The corner of Beach, are they sensing that Foster keeps taking a rest? And that's what they're, that's what they're shouting at Beach. Again, a good start from Foster in the early stages of this round. First 30 seconds, it's kind of been a pattern. Beach's game as they come, it just catches a couple more looks on the inside there from Foster. That was good work again from the champion. 
Yeah, he's just had a little injection, as you say, of pace, John, in this uh, round as Foster. He's put his punches together very well on the inside combos again, eye-catching combinations. Fired in another good body shot there. That left hand has been a, a hurtful weapon for Foster. Two guys who you just, you know, they just both want to win it. They both want to win that belt. Foster's been the stronger over these last two or three rounds, though. And he looks full, more full of energy as they come now towards the last 30 seconds. There was that big left hook again, forcing Beach back. And he's in a bit of trouble, wanting to hold on. Dog tired now. Yeah, he really is tired. Young Beach, Foster finishing strong. Faster combos. Another hurtful left hook into the solar plexus of Beach. Last 10 seconds of what's been a fascinating fight. Beach bravely seeing it through to the final bell. Judges, Howard Foster and Terry O'Connor both see the contest. 1-1-7, one, 1-1-1. One, 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 one. All for the winner. And still, the British and Commonwealth Super Bantamweight Champion, Brad the Blade Foster.